Has this ever happened to you? You're working, and so many things are happening at one time. So many people are calling your name. Scooter! 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 You have so many things to do. You have to get... To, you have a test Thursday. Subscribe now. Clean your room. Meeting at 6. Get the milk. So much stuff! And you all write on sticky notes. Yes. The infamous sticky note. And you want this on your desktop instead of your face. Well, watch this video now. So, here we go. Now, we're going to talk about getting these sticky notes on your Mac. So, look no further and watch now. Here we go. When I snap my fingers, all these sticky notes will be on my desktop. Ready. Set. Oh, alright. So, as you see now, all of these are on my uh, desktop. So, uh, Mac OS X. They have a built-in application. It's called Stickies. Uh, it looks like this on my dock. Pretty much Sticky Notes. Stickies, or uh, you can go to your Finder or type it in a Spotlight and type in. Um, if you type in Stick, it'll come up. Stick, and there it is. Stickies. So just type that in, and you'll see it. All right. So once you get it up, um, either you'll have one automatic default uh, blank Sticky Note, or you'll have the one you've already made. So uh, just say we're gonna have a default Sticky. This is our default sticky I just made. All right, so it's yellow as you see, and when you get it, you can write anything you want. You can write gibberish. You can write YouTube. You can write subscribe now. You can write this video was good. Anything you want, and it's just like that. So that's just the basics of, of stickies. Let's go into the customizable part. So let me go ahead and close this out. Oh, uh, don't say that one. Alright, so uh, there's a couple things you might want to know here at the top of the menu bar. Some pretty important things. Uh, obviously, you have stickies, just stuff like that. File, uh, to make a new note, you can hit Command N or hit this button. To close one, you can hit uh, Command W. To import a text, all that, just hit, uh, just go to File. Uh, edit, same thing, very simple. Uh, we'll, uh, speech, spelling, you know, make sure everything is spelled right. Uh, we'll come back to font in a minute. Uh, note is very cool. You can make it as customizable, uh, translucent. So uh, it's translucent now, and if I move this one around, then the apple will show through it. It's pretty neat, huh? So, and if I don't want that to happen, then just hit uh, translucent off, and it'll work. Same way. Uh, color. You can uh, make sure you click the sticky note you want and change the color. Uh, as you see, it's changing right now, back to gray. So. Um, that's that. Um, window, you can make it, you can you know, collapse them, minimize them, or whatever, or uh, just change between them right here. So now I'm on uh, this one, I believe. And, or you can just click the click the one you want, doesn't matter, same thing. And then obviously you got help. Uh, so let's go ahead and go back to, um, to note, or let's go to font, sorry. Uh, to show fonts, would you want to type it in? You can uh, hit, go up to note and hit show fonts, and uh, pretty much it'll come up. And you can show the font. So if I if I want to highlight subscribe and uh, change the font, then boom, it's changed to that. So uh, very simple there. Uh, very cool. You can you know just like an iMovie, make it bigger, make it smaller, uh, change the color um, of it. You can go uh, to font, go to show colors, right there, and then the colors will highlight the text you want, and then boom, colors will start changing. Uh, so as you see, I've already changed some colors here for you. Uh, over here as well, got some. So that's pretty much the basic things of stickies. Uh, this is just a quick video, uh, but now I want to tell you one more thing before we leave. One more thing. Uh, let me go ahead and close these out. Don't save. Oh, as well, uh, when you want to close a window or close a sticky, it'll ask you to save it. But if you quit the application, they don't ask you. They'll just repop back up when you open it up again. But if I want to close subscribe one, I'd hit Command W and it asked me to save it. And now if I quit it and open it back up, then boom, it's back up there. Now, uh, let's say that since you love stickies and you want to remember things very easily, you can have this open up at startup. Very, very simple. Uh, you're going to go to System Preferences down here. Once you get to System Preferences, go to, um, go to Accounts. Once you get into Accounts, hit Login Items. You have two things where you can change your password and uh, or account picture. Or you can uh, go to login items. Go to login items, and uh, right here we see these items will automatically open when you log in. 
So what will happen? Uh, you hit the add down here and go to your applications or search stickies. All right. So there they are. I'd hit that and hit add. And from now on, when my computer starts up, uh, stickies will start up as well. Very, very easy tool, and you can do this with any application. So those are just quick tips right there. I uh, hope you've enjoyed this quick video talking about how you can take these and put them on your desktop. Thanks, and comment, rate, and comment, rate, and subscribe. Hope you're watching high quality, and uh, check out some more of my other vids. Thanks. Peace.